Hello, Creative Gems. Welcome to Creativity. I'm Sandy. Today, I'm going to do something amazing with these clear plastic spoons and use them to make a one-of-a-kind glam decor piece that can be used as a candle holder, but can also double as a wall decor piece if hung on the wall. To help us out with today's home decor craft project, we will also need a few additional supplies from the Dollar Tree, including some of these silver plastic spoons, which come in a 24 pack. We will also be using this medium sized round mirror, some silver beaded necklace, some fix all, some weld bond, which I bought on Amazon, or any white glue from the dollar store will do, and we will also need our handy dandy hot glue gun. To begin, we will need to disassemble the round framed mirror I found at the Dollar Tree. Put the frame aside for a future project. You will notice that the cardboard backing is a bit larger than the mirror. You'll also notice that on one side of the cardboard backing, there is a hook. Place that side of the cardboard backing directly onto the table surface. Then place the mirror flat onto the cardboard backing so we can trace the shape of the mirror. Once the mirror shape has been traced onto the cardboard backing, take a pair of scissors and cut the circular shape out. And while we work on that, I would like to take a moment to thank all the returning viewers to my channel for tuning in to today's craft project. If you are visiting for the first time, I would like to extend a warm welcome. And if you enjoy glam home decor and DIY crafts on a budget, I would love it if you would support my channel by hitting the subscribe button so you can be notified of my future DIY craft videos. Then apply some glue to the cardboard backing. Make sure you apply the glue to the side that does not have the hook, since we will be using the hook later to hang it onto the wall. You'll notice that I am applying some white glue, but I'm also adding some fix-all. The fix-all will give extra hold so the mirror will secure firmly to the cardboard backing. Once the mirror is placed firmly onto the cardboard backing, take some silver beaded necklace and using some hot glue, adhere the beaded necklace all along the border edge of the mirror. The beaded necklace will hide the seam between the mirror and the cardboard backing. Once done, put the mirror aside while we work on our spoons. Let me first show you one of the clear plastic spoons. See how beautifully shaped this spoon is. The curves are so elegant and perfect to use as a decor piece as you will see soon. First, we are going to take some more of the silver beaded necklace and using some hot glue, we are going to embellish the clear plastic spoons by adhering the beaded necklace all around the end of the spoon. Make sure you dispense the hot glue in very small amounts so the glue doesn't clump up around the spoon.
And here is what the spoon looks like. You can also see I have made a total of eight spoons and I'm placing them all around the mirror. Take your time to position the spoons to ensure they are evenly spaced. Before we glue them down though, we are going to add another embellishment to the clear spoons. Here I have broken off the round part of the silver plastic spoons and adhering one face down onto each spoon. Once again, a little hot glue goes a long way. The next step is to adhere each spoon to the mirror's edge. When all the spoons are set in place, slowly and carefully flip the piece around so we can add some more glue to the back to reinforce the hold of the spoons to the mirror. Then carefully flip the mirror right side up and take a dry paintbrush and use it to remove any glue strings that may have been left behind. Once done, make sure to use your favorite glass cleaner to wipe away any marks or fingerprints on the mirror surface. In the final steps of embellishments, I decided that I needed to amp up the glam factor, so I added a row of small clear round gem stickers down the center of the handle of each spoon. And here I am taking an old candle that I had for years and applying two types of silver ribbon all around the candle. This step is optional, especially if you already have a pretty candle that you like. Mine was purchased many, many years ago and has yellowed over time, so applying the silver ribbons will give it a fresh look.
And here I've placed the large candle onto the mirror and voila! This is what our new mirrored candle holder looks like. And see how the spoons lay onto the table so elegantly. And here I have placed a vase of flowers on top. This is also a very beautiful look. And finally, for our third look, I have hung the mirror onto the wall and now we have a beautiful 3D mirror. The spoons spread out around the mirror like sun rays. Or if you take a second look, the wall mirror also looks like a large glam flower. Comment down below and let me know which look you like best. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to my channel and share with other creative gems. Also, hit the notification bell and stay tuned for more glam home decor looks.